we today, guys? Sharp on the steak. So why sharp on the steak, you'd say? Basically, we haven't done it yet. And it's a relatively new park run. They've only been doing this for roughly a year and a bit. There's a sign. There's a sign, guys. It's quite a long walk. Ta-da! But yeah, sadly, there's no free parking at this one. The parking was only about two pound though, so for two hours, not too shabby. It's cool because we were looking on the website yesterday, and it's quite a chunky <coughs> like explanation of how to get to the start. Yeah, it's so quite we're, beefy. We're quite worried. There's two main car parks. Just use Ringo. Simple. But yeah, actually, there was a marshal there and the signs leading. Yeah, there was a marshal all the way at the car park. And that's a 15 minute walk from the start, I think. So yeah. that was a nice surprise. <laughs> yeah, there's arrows the whole way. It's like we're on course already. But the cool thing is, well, it's not very cool for us anyway, but it's cool for you. But we looked at the classic running index. Boom. And I think it's about 675th out of 760 park runs. Since we're in Devon, I've been doing a few Devon runs. I did a 28k run on Wednesday. Yeah, Here I didn't do it that, Hayley didn't want to do that one. About 1300 meters of elevation, why not? <laughs> so, I currently cannot feel my quads, it's just each step's a bit of pain. And then we did a run the day after. And it was really rainy. Oh yeah. <laughs> we were going to go and get brunch but we decided not to soggy up all the chairs. <laughs> so we just got a takeaway item. They've got, no, they've got more signs here than on the run I reckon. <laughs> you are not allowed a double buggy here. And you're not allowed to bring a dog because it's near some animal fields. Quite a small little park run really. Normally there's between 70 to 100 people here on average. You liking the way to the start Hayley? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We haven't done a warm up yet. Pretty, but I'm scared to see the hill. Hills. How bad is it? Uh, I didn't go properly to it, but my legs don't feel happy at all. So, if you have any questions at all, <laughs> I'm here or ask any of the other high vis heroes that we have. I just need to give a brief description of the course. It's really straightforward. I don't think you can get lost. It's literally straight that way, and eventually you'll meet someone with a magic cone, and then you come back. It is a little bit hilly, um, so you might want to be a bit cautious there. My brother told me it wasn't hilly at all when I first done it, and he lied to me. It's a bit slippery, there are lots of brambles, so just keep in the centre if you can. Two minutes later. Okay, fine. Runners, are you ready? Three, two, one, go!
thank you. <laughs> We've just completed Sharpham Estate Park Run. It was very, very drizzly, which I kind of liked. But we're it was. Under, we're under woodland though. It was humid as hell. I managed to win. And considering my wow. quads feel bruised as hell. <laughs> well, I'm quite happy with that. <laughs> I'll put our times and positions on our faces. And, and here's the pacing. Boom, the pacing. Uh, but yeah, as you can see from this elevation chart, it was not a very flat water run. And considering my PB 1621, I did like about 1826, so nearly two minutes slower. It was very beautiful, like looking like It was on the scenic, way out. and I don't know if you appreciate it. Or yeah, not. it was scenic. <laughs> sort of horses, cows. The cone was a physical <laughs> person in a cone, <laughs> which is magical a cone. magical cone. <laughs> the people were very friendly. wasn't too busy. I reckon if there was like 300 people or so, the carnage. But because there's not oh, that many yeah. people. It's quite a nice amount. <laughs> Question is, did I walk? The answer is yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did. I did walk at three and a half k. But Only once though. But no, twice. Oh. <laughs> Do your legs still hurt? The answer is yes. My legs hurt. They didn't get any worse. It kind of subsided in the run, but there was definitely going to be fatigue there, so that's definitely partly to blame. I reckon I probably could have done it with fresh legs, maybe 15, 20 seconds quicker. I feel like it's not really... I mean, you could do it quick, because the downs were quick. I think, I think the quickest around here... <laughs> I was here running is, at 5k pace. I think the quickest easy. around here is around 16, 11-ish. But now, we've got a three and a half hour drive home. Come for the views. Come for the downs. Uh, be warned of the ups. It was nice. It's a nice community. You can tell like everyone really cares about it. But yeah, imagine if you're the marshal at the two and a half k turnaround, and it's an out and back. So it's quite a long cycle ride. <laughs> joined our channel there might be quite a few new faces around here because i filmed my runs video which Oof. massive thank you <laughs> thank you everybody wow. yeah very very positive review which was somehow cool. we're in the top seven <laughs> honored it was so weird seeing ourselves on tv and it's not our video <laughs> so i all know what videos you're gonna pull out um yeah, thank you all. And then, as always, let us know if you've got suggestions for the next one. And also, follow Film My Run here, guys. And subscribe to us if you haven't already. Do it. Do it now. We're off. Bye, guys. Bye. On to the next one. Adventure.